Want to learn how to create this awesome effect? Stay tuned! Hey, this is Chloe from Watershare from Mora here to empower your inner video creator. Everything Everywhere All At Once is an awesome film with awesome effects, especially the verse jump effect. Did you know it's actually pretty easy to recreate the verse jump effect in Fomorato? Let me show you how. Oh, by the way, during this movie award season, it's a great time to make some cinematic videos. In Fomorato, there are a large number of cinematic resources, such as special effects, transitions, templates, text, and sound effects that will help you take your videos to the next level. And if you haven't already downloaded the all new Fomora Tell, get started at FomoraTheWannaShare.com or click the link in the description. And let's go! First, we're going to need to film our footage in two parts. The first part is simple. Grab your camera or phone and just start walking through your city or area while filming. Try to keep the camera at eye level. If your camera has shutter speed settings, set it to a slow setting like one second or more to get a nice blurry exposure. You're going to need a lot of this footage since we're going to speed it up later. Try to find interesting location with new colors as well. Now for the second part, filming yourself. You can do this effect in two ways using Fomar Tall. One is green screen and the second one is the smart cutout tool. Check out these videos on our channel for more in-depth tutorials for both features. For this video, I'm going to use a green screen with the chroma key feature. Position yourself in front of the green screen and pretend like you're flying backwards at super speed, like this. Again, you will need a lot of this footage since we are increasing the speed. So make sure you record enough. Now, let's jump into Fumar and finish up this effect. Start by placing your background footage on one layer and your subject footage on a layer above. For convenience, I've already stitched my background footage together into one file. Click on your background footage, go to speed, and bump the speed up like crazy until you are satisfied with the result. Now, click on your subject footage, go to video, AI tools, and select chroma key or smart cutout if you are using that feature. Now, all you need to do is speed up your subject footage just like your background. And you're almost done. Here's the tricky part. Click on your subject footage and go to color. Now, you are going to go through your video one second at a time and look for changes in lighting and color temperature. Every time the color or lighting changes, create a new keyframe by clicking this button for the color setting you're changing. The two big ones to keep in mind are exposure and temperature. Just click the keyframe button, match it to the shot, and so on. As a bonus, you can add extra effects in Fomora 12 to make it even cooler. Try adding the rotate blur effect to your background to make it even more convincing. Or my favorite, the anime speed lines effect. At the end, you should have something that looks like this. And now you know how to jump between universe just like everything everywhere all at once. I hope you can use your new powers wisely. What other effects do you want us to recreate in Fomora Talk? Let us know in the comments! Thanks for watching and make sure to like and subscribe for new videos on the channel. Keep creating and see you next time!